All right, I've tanked up. We got we got stuff. There's nothing I can do with this. Let's just dive in. All right, I'm gonna just summon, summon Buddy. We want to get to that energy. Oh, I see. Shell just turned on my TV. That's why my display was freaking out for a hot second. It might look a little weird for a little bit because my computer gets kind of funky. Um. Unfortunately, I don't have the energy to tank here, so let's just go for the meta currency. There we go. Yeah, I want that extra energy, but... Ain't risking biscuits for it. Let's see. Only time you hated Frisbee. We were talking about Frisbee before this, but only time you ever hated Frisbee was when they forced you to play Ultimate Frisbee instead of Dodgeball. Dodgeball is pretty fun. I liked Ultimate Frisbee, but it wasn't, like, incredibly good. Okay. We're going to start with a new gun. Sniper or damage gun? 100% sniper. Long range. Good damage. I can slap it on this guy so he isn't just suddenly turdsville. Okay. Then upgrades. Can I upgrade the sniper so it just does a flat 10 damage at a 3 range? I like that. Unfortunately... It won't let me update this guy for whatever reason. I guess when you switch the weapon... Oh, gosh. That... Well, that sucks. Nah, I should have this guy hang out. Because, unfortunately... He only does... What? Four damage? Four damage. Which makes these guys inherently problematic. I'm not going to be able to grab the energy off of this one. Luckily, I'll still be able to take them one and out. Yeah, I don't think switching weapons counts as an upgrade in the game. Which sucks. Okay. I know we have actions available. That does not matter to me. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able, I'm not gonna be able to get to this. It's okay. I'll get get to it later. Once I have like proper proper super tank characters, none of this will be a problem. Or maybe it will continue to be a problem. We'll see. Okay, engineering. Max. Okay. Mischief. Adjacent swarm. Oh, receive extra damage from attacks. Or booster. Or of plus one movement at the start of turn. I'm gonna go with that. It's not incredibly good. I'm gonna go for the mini jet. Alright. Back to you, you get the machine gun. And then we're gonna just make a new boy. There we go. So I still don't have too much. And he probably costs too much to spawn, energy-wise. Yeah, it costs nine. But now we have battle plane. Okay. Okay, he's not gonna kill us. Might kill that guy, though.
This part kind of sucks. Okay, move you here. Drop this guy on that. And then we snipe it. Ouch. I lost some frames there. Only so much I can do, unfortunately. Uh, let's see. Buy credits. Could. What else can we afford? So, flies over tiles and units. Eh, it's good. I'm going to get another body. Impervious. Or missile head. So, impervious is really slow. But does not die. Missile head is more gun. I'm gonna go missile head. More gun sounds good. Yeah, but tank. Yeah. Okay, so the big deal here is these guys, unfortunately, are hella fast. Okay, none of these guys can hit, so we can snipe this dude. I want that energy. Gonna be difficult to get it, though. Well, I'll take the energy. Your sacrifice is in vain. I forgot once again that the machine gun is a melee weapon. But I dig the sniper. Uh, let's see. What else do we want? There's upgrades, but like none of them are really good. Going on a new weapon, a new body, new legs. Let's do new weapon. Minigun is always solid. Neutralizer is not that good. Okay, mechs. So let's put together the rudimentary missile boy. He costs eight to spawn. Well, that should be fine. And if we're lucky, he can just, uh, he can blast. Oh, it's a boss battle. Oh, good. Oh, fun. Oh, golly gee. I think we're in trouble. We'll see how it goes. much I can do about this. I wildly underestimated how freaking tanky that dude is. Okay. We're just gonna have to... No, we're dead. 
I should have gotten for the meta progression. Wow. That was rough. Well, I, at least I got some meta energy. Uh, garbage collection, starting credits, starting energy. Go starting credits. Let's do a new run. That was barely anything. Looks like I start with one of these. Challenges offer increased difficulty and rewards. I don't think so. Okay. Ow. Wow, this is... Hot trash. Every there we go. That's slightly better. Hopefully at some point they make it so I can get some more. Choose the tanky guy you chose guns. I'm aware. Like, telling me exactly what I did wrong, like, yeah. I know. I know what, I know what I didn't do right. I got greedy thinking, yeah, maybe I can go for big guns. And the answer is no. I can't go for big guns. And sure, fly on me for messing that up, but oh well. Like, informing me of that is, uh, on a, frankly, not that much more than browbeating, technically. Okay, so we got Bupkiss last time, and unfortunately, we're probably going to be kind of in the Bupkiss territory. Mini Missile Pod is... Not great. Minigun is better. Develop a body. Chain reaction. Attack again after a kill. Tempting. Tempting. I mean, it's better than booster. Mega walker. Move after action. Okay. So, we've kind of created Killmonger. Kill... Killdozer? Killmanzer? Uh, let's see. And I can't quite upgrade the minigun. Okay. Do I go forward? Yeah, if I can if I can get somebody on here. We're good. Oh. Well, here's kind of an annoyance, but only a mild one. We didn't do enough damage. Minigun. Now, for Lucky, this guy becomes obscene. <laughs> Oh, should we name him? Are we, are we voting to name him Bucket Man? We'll just call him Bucket. Alright. And upgrades. We're upgrading the minigun. Alright. Bucket has been new, improved. Uh, let's see. Do we get another one of these little guys? No, 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 no. Let's not waste our energy here. The big issue is the troll is kind of in my way. There we go. I you gotta admit, Bucket is just kind of obscene. Early game at the very least. Engineering. Uh upgrades. What if I upgrade it? So he gets more HP and refunds one movement after act acting. Tempting. 
Let's get a weapon. Oh, there it is. Alright, Bucket. You have now become unbeatable. Question mark. I mean, not fully. we still got stuff to do. Whoops. But if I can, if I can upgrade this, it's going to cost a lot. We've become absurd. Uh, battle? I don't know what we're up against. I don't know where I can move. Okay, and we got three of these crawlers. Oh, he doesn't have the shield yet. This could get dicey. These crawlers are annoying. Okay, I should be able to get the meta currency. I don't think I'll be able to get anything more. But that's okay. Bucket takes no prisoners. Bucket is just warp speed. Strong. Uh, let's see. Do we want to buy credits for energy? No. Because unfortunately, I don't actually get upgraded Bucket yet. Kind of blows. Like, I have to let this bucket die to get real bucket. Oh, in that case, I should probably take this thing back. Oh, this is bad. I don't know if I have enough juice for that. Okay, he can't do anything. No kill. This guy got, does way too much damage. Alright, let's hope we have just enough. Oh, we cost 16. That sucks. I have a silly plan. What if Storm kill Goliath? Got him. <laughs> oh, it's cheap shit, but what else was I going to do? Oh, let's go for that. Okay, I need my energy, so I can't do too much. I can upgrade the energy shield. Okay, here's the problem. I need a boogie for that land on it, and then hold it for two turns, and I'm probably not going to get that. We'll see how slow these guys go. 
Oh, that's just rough terrain, and I can't do that. God damn it. Damn it. I lose. At least we get the meta currency. I the start of this game is brutal. Like you either get something incredible or you stink and die. And like losing your good mech, I mean clearly I've it's a case of too many uh, eggs one basket. What I should have done was actually uh switch the bucket chassis onto the uh the just like basic tread legs and not done what I did. That was Well we got five meta currency that gets me something. Uh I mean the other one is potentially saving up for like generator or a couple other things. I'm just gonna go for the starting credits. Okay. Unfortunately, it's getting a little late. I want to keep going, but... Yeah. No, we'll, we'll try it, like, one more time. All these maps are just bad for me, too. Not a big deal, but it's kind of one of those where it's like, I really need to get to you and hold this energy. For multiple rounds. If I can do that, we're in a very good spot. If I can't, uh... Alright, we're good. Oh, we're very good. Because, yeah, they're going to be coming for me one at a time. Here. And I can just gun them down. And I'm not going to say I'm going to get a full lineup of energy here, but it's going to be enough to summon something big if I if I want to. Okay. And we're good. Perfect. Little men are coming for you, Wander. See, I can work with the little men. It's the other guys... They're the spooky ones. Alright, we get a gun. Never mind, we don't get a gun. We get a body. Not big on that one. Let's see if we can get another chunkier thing. Eagle Eye. Adjacent mechs get extra damage or Maximus. There we go. And transport. Just walker or tank. Move further on roads, move after action. Now let's go tank. Tank gives a little bit of armor. And now... Oh, let's go back. Alright. And I guess I'll just give him the double-double for the time being. So he does cost 14 to summon. But... That's fine. We have 14. Um... Kind of a useless mech. <laughs> At least for now. Engineering, can I get a weapon? No. But that's fine. There we go. Because we've got we've got our battle boy. We've got the man. That can just hang on a spot and never die. Oh, there's another energy spot over there. Uh, I guess I'll start going for it. Because, yeah, he's got nine armor and counters damage back. Like, that's really good. Okay. And this time I've actually given him a halfway competent gun. 
It's not an incredible gun, but it's halfway competent. And they're just gonna kill him, kill themselves trying to kill him. There we go. We're full up on energy. And we're good. Okay, uh, let's see. So I could buy some stuff, or we could potentially upgrade Maximus or the tank. Upgrading the tank ain't great. Let's upgrade Maximus. And then, yeah. Burn all of our energy for some credits. We have an upgrade pending. Oh, that's fine. I'll get it. I'll get it next time. There we go. Yeah, I I'm going to I'm going to say it seems like the the meta strategy at least for the early game on this is very much get get the shield or get something with sufficient armor that it can't just get killed. And then after that everything else is just kind of gravy. Okay, now I could shoot it, but I kind of want to put it off as long as possible. Oh, I see. I have, I have actions available, but I want that energy, because that energy is money. Double down that a fast sniper flyer could be a good start. I haven't found anything that is sufficiently fast for my tastes, but I do agree with you. Okay, back, engineering. I'm gonna find a different weapon, if I can. Zapper, airstrike. These are kind of bad. So I could get the gunner drone again, but I didn't like it. Missile pod on the other hand. Let's see, stun seems good for farming energy. Nah, you're right. Sucker's a little expensive to spawn. Oh, but that's fine. I know why it's expensive to spawn. Um, what are the upgrades like? Because what's the upgrade of this? Seven damage. And the upgrade of this is no cooldown. Fair. Okay, and I'm just going to scrap this guy. Shields up, but let's shoot this boy. Because, yeah, we don't have a minigun yet. Kind of limits what we can do. Okay. All right. Got our shields up. And yeah, he can just sit here for as long as possible. I very much would like to find some core upgrades that would make him um, even tougher. So we should... I want to keep looking for bodies and I want to keep looking for... Um, uh, let's see. For bodies and for guns. Because really just like... One goofed out super mech does the trick. Do I want to switch? Well, we don't want a body in retrospect. So I guess we want a weapon. Well, there's the medic drone or the sniper. Gosh, both of these are good. 
Um, I'm going to go with the sniper. The medic is nice. Medic feels better? <sighs> Maybe you're right. But I, I'm thinking just long range damage on Chombo. Seems like even better. Uh, let's lose the taser. Just give it the gun. Unfortunately, this guy is not, uh, not that great. Okay, engineering. We'll do one, but only one, because I think it's boss battle time. And I kind of want to save my Gibbs, because I don't think these guys can do enough damage. No, he can do enough damage. Yeah, maybe the medic dro droid would have been the right idea. Oh, wait. Here we go. Easy answer. So the reason why I want to have this is because he gives adjacent mechs plus two armor. Making this guy really tough to kill. Okay. Then we have the double double. Then we have the double double double. And then we shields up. Obviously, he loses no. That adjacency works on the diagonal. And then we can just fire missiles. Perfect. There we go. We got him. He good. We good. Okay, mechs can move and attack after spawning or... No, infinite loop is way better. This one is solid, but this one is stupid. Oh, and everything is really expensive. All of the time. Damage gun, mine launcher. I like the idea of the landmine. Oh, let's see, that's the regular machine gun. I wish I could sell things. He is cheap. Okay. Battle. One fear. I think I'll be okay. Who looks like a duck? Looks like a duck, and it's a duck, it's a duck. Alright, now these guys are going to evolve because I didn't kill them fast enough. I should have moved it forward. Damn it, I needed that energy. How does this work? Push. Push mech one tile. Oh, it only works on friendly units. Yeah, I think I'm going to lose here. Because the status effect is going to kill us. 
I forgot. I've been immune to status All effects that for that now. entire last run. Don't worry. I'll have you back on. Oh, that's a shame. I get some more points at least, but that's a shame. Well, it's fine. This game's still super fun. It does seem like it'll open up tremendously. Yeah, you mean the last, last, last run. The good run. But yeah, the delayed damage was brutal. I didn't even realize because I'm not used to it because I was previously immune to status effects. And it's fine. Uh, we definitely want to get the uh, options upgrade. That seems really strong. But anyway... I think for now, I think I'm I think I'm just gonna say we're we're in a good position. I'll come back for more of this on probably Wednesday, because this seems like exactly my kind of game. Really fun, a lot of different cheese you can do. It seems a little limited laterally. We've seen a lot of the same parts go by, and it also seems a little unbalanced around like potentially just struggling a lot until you've gotten enough meta upgrades, uh to the point where you can actually start uh you know, properly playing. And I'm curious what would happen if I had, like, a, a f just maxed out the entirety of the, the meta progression system, you know, how much that would change this game. Probably would actually turn it into cakewalk mode for a while, but I'm not necessarily against the idea of that, at least until the 1.0 when things are a little bit smoother, because I don't really like the idea of just trying and failing a bunch of times in, like, the first level. But maybe that's just a me thing. For now, though, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.